Envision 1664, a time when grandeur was a sign of power and beauty. That's when the story of Nymphenburg Palace begins. In the heart of Munich, Elector Ferdinand Maria decided to construct this architectural marvel as an expression of joy, a gift to his beloved wife, Adelheid of Savoy. This was to celebrate the birth of their long-awaited heir, a moment of joy that demanded a monument to match. The palace was initially designed in the early Baroque style, embodying a certain modest elegance that was typical of the era. It was the combined genius of architects like Agostino Borelli and Enrico Zuccali, among others, that brought the vision of Ferdinand Maria to life. Their hands crafted the early contours of what would eventually become a symbol of royal grandeur. Thus, Nymphenburg Palace, initially a symbol of joyous parenthood, began its journey from a modest summer residence to a grand royal estate. As years passed, Nymphenburg Palace grew, much like the air it was built to celebrate. Under the reigns of Max Emanuel and Karl Albrecht, the palace expanded, not just in size but in grandeur. The addition of galleries, wings and ornate decorations transformed this once modest hunting lodge into a grand summer residence, a testament to the ambitions of its royal inhabitants. This metamorphosis didn't stop there. Nymphenburg Palace became one of the biggest royal palaces in Europe, a symbol of the power and prestige of the Bavarian monarchy. Each expansion brought with it a different architectural style, reflecting the changing tastes of the time. The palace became a canvas, painted with the rich hues of Baroque, the delicate strokes of Rococo, and the bold lines of neoclassical elements. These styles merged seamlessly, creating a unique fusion that stands as a testament to the artistic evolution of the era. Through the centuries, Nymphenburg Palace evolved, reflecting the changing tastes and ambitions of its royal inhabitants. Fast forward to the present day, and Nymphenburg Palace stands as an iconic testament to Bavarian history and architecture. Gloriously evolving from a love token to a royal residence, this palace now welcomes everyone from far and wide. It's not just a beautiful Baroque facade, but a bustling hub of culture and history, housing several fascinating museums and hosting various engaging events. Within its grand walls, the palace harbors the famous Hall of Mirrors, a spectacle of lavish decor and intricate artwork that leaves visitors spellbound. And let's not forget the expansive Palace Park, a verdant wonderland crisscrossed with canals and dotted with charming pavilions, providing a serene escape from the bustling city life. The palace doesn't just stand as a monument, but actively contributes to preserving and showcasing Bavarian history and culture, making every visit a journey through time. Today, Nymphenburg Palace, once a personal gift of love, has transformed into a gift for all, a captivating blend of history, architecture, and culture.